Hello everyone, how are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about iOS 16 Beta 5 on iPhone XR. Yes, oh my god, the iPhone XR on the iOS 16 performs really, really well. I am really surprised by the performance of iPhone XR on the iOS 16. Oh my god, this device performs amazing. But, but, but at the same time, there is a big issue for iPhone 11 and iPhone XR users. Actually, it is an issue for devices with LCD. I think so because if you see devices like iPhone XR and iPhone 11, those devices does not support the battery percentage. That is such a neat and such a great thing that Apple added. Oh my god, probably one of the only most useful thing Apple added, which will be used by widely by pretty much everyone, a feature on new operating system which will be used by pretty much 99% of the users upgrading to this firmware. That is a big thing. And finally, we have this. We used to jailbreak and get this on our iPhones and oh my god, look, Apple added the exact same thing. They got inspired from jailbreak community. This thing looks exactly like we have on jailbreak devices. The exact same mod that we have on jailbreak. Oh my god, exact one-to-one -one replica. But apparently it works on iPhone 10, iPhone 10s, but not on iPhone 10R, not on iPhone 11. Mm, that's mm, I am still processing why is that a thing? Why it just does not work on iPhone 10R and iPhone 11? Like seriously, for a second, even if I'll say that it won't work on iPhone 10R, okay, that's an old device. All right, fair enough. And that was also a device which was considered as a budget device, more of a not exactly budget device at the price they launched at. But all right, the first device which was caused. Uh, which costed less than the flagship device and was released with the flagship device. So, I don't know. Okay, for a second, I can process it. It is not available on the iPhone XR, but still it doesn't make sense. It should be available on iPhone XR, but it is just not available. I'm so mad at Apple for just doing this. Why is it not available? The battery percentage thing should be on every iPhone with a notch. Talking about the bugs, there was a really big bug on pretty much every iPhone, on my iPhone XR, on my iPhone 11, on my iPhone 12, 12 Pro Max. Pretty much all of my devices had this bug and this bug, it was the volume bug and all of you guys had this too and you guys just DM'd me on Twitter at the rate tech hyped. I'm most active there. You can just DM me there. I'll talk to you about any issue related to iPhone and any query you have related to iOS. Just DM me there and we'll be friends. Yes, most welcome. I just love iPhone XR on the iOS 16 Beta 5. iOS 16 Beta 5 is a really amazing update. I am really surprised that I'm saying this because uh, iPhone XR, iPhone 11, iPhone 12, all basically all iPhones on iOS 16 Beta 4 was really, really bad. It just sucked in general. It was just so, so bad. If you have watched my previous video, you know it was so bad. But I'm really surprised how Apple worked and they improved so many things on the beta 5 of iOS 16. This is just magnificent, no cap. The iOS 16 beta 5 is a really amazing update. Should you install it on your device? Well, for sure, if you are already on iOS 16 beta, if you are not on iOS 16 beta and you want to try the battery percentage thing, on iPhone XR, that's not a case, so it's not worth installing uh, iOS 16 beta on your device. Well, that's pretty much it for this video. If you did end up liking this video, consider hitting that subscribe button. And if you're new here, I keep on making iPhone and iOS related content for you guys. So you do not have to miss those videos. Turn on notification. I will catch you guys in the very next episode. And uh, stay safe, everyone.